Stefano Esposito, how you doing? I'm doing great. How are you doing? Good seeing you, man. So we're talking about Hector Duarte, a guy that we're pretty familiar with at the jam. He's known for a lot of murals uh, in Pilsen, and he's got a big one in particular that is actually on his house. Can you tell me about that? Yeah, it's kind of incredible. It's It goes down the, f the full east side of his house. It's 100 feet long. It's a Latino version of Gulliver from the 18th century um, Jonathan Swift novel. Hmm. And it's supposed to represent uh, the sort of immigrant struggle at the border, and this guy is enmeshed in barbed wire. It's really quite dramatic. It's uh, something to see if you haven't seen it. What was the first thing that came to your mind when you saw this massive mural? Uh, it's, both, it's both really quite magnificent and kind of terrifying, frankly, because it looks like the guy kind of giving up the fight or, or whether he's in the middle of a struggle. This mural, I mean, obviously it's, it's huge, it's massive. How long did it take? for Hector to do this? He started it in 2001, and I think it took him about four years. But it, you know, it's on his own house, so he wasn't getting paid for it. And this project you guys have on the city of murals, massive in scope, really ambitious. Why do you think it's important to spotlight the city's art scene? Because we have, it's such an incredible city, and I grew up in London and I, in the 1970s, and I don't remember anything like this. When people pick up your piece and read it. What do you hope they take away about Hector and this mural? Well, I hope they get to know him. I mean, I didn't know anything about Hector, um, and I hope it will inspire people to go down there. And I bet you this has garnered a lot of response from people. What's been the reaction from the community? You know what's kind of interesting is that um, he, <laughs> uh, he said at first nobody really noticed it. And I think really? that, yeah, which is, again, because the piece is so dramatic, mm -hmm. you think people would notice. But it, it speaks to Pilsen. Pilsen is, you know, sort of, a, it's an it's a outdoor art gallery. As, as his fame grew, uh, more and more people came. A major tourist attraction. Exactly. That's yeah. really awesome. All right, man. Thanks a lot. My pleasure.